Hey, what's up guys? So, a couple of things. So, I'm going to be really honest with you today, okay, about everything pretty much. I'm in the Crown Championship Challenge, and so far it looks like we are um, eight wins in. So, we're eight and one. We're not doing too bad. Um, and I'm really reluctant to do this while I'm recording because I don't play as well, obviously, when I'm recording because I'm trying to focus on being able to explain exactly what I'm doing, and I'm just not at that level that I'm that good that I can be like, dude, I'm just dropping a golem here, whatevs, you know, and it's doing good, you know, so anyway, so it's hard for me to play in these challenges or uh, actually even anywhere really while I'm recording. I'm trying to do better, trying to do better, and I think I am getting better, but it's still a work in progress for me. Anyway, so... Here's what I'm going to do today that I thought would be kind of cool because I started doing this and I'm like, dude, is this just by coincidence that this is working? But it's like a little tip that I found or a theory that I kind of have. And it could just be sheer coincidence and we're going to find out right now in this video basically if it's coincidence or not. But I think I figured something out. So I've been using this Golem deck and I have been using the Night Witch, which she's does pretty dang well for me um, still even though she got nerfed pretty hard she does extremely well she's able to take out a hog pretty decently and a lot of people are playing with the hog right now we have the golem to take out all the expos even though of my nine wins I have not faced one expo or mortar so that's just a thought which I thought was weird anyway it has something to do with the matchmaking I know for sure the matchmaking really isn't rigged, but it definitely seems like, depending on the deck that you have, you do face certain things. And I know you guys feel it as well. So this little theory or this little tip has a lot to do with the matchmaking um, and a theory that I have as far as that goes. And so what I've been doing is I go and I play a battle on the ladder. Okay, and I don't do extremely well and I lose. Okay, so I'm like, okay, I, lo I lose, right? And so after I lose, then I go right over to the challenge and I play a battle. And I seem to do okay. Like it matches me up against something that's not my direct counter. And so I do okay. So it's great. And I don't know if it's just by happenstance that I win after losing. It's just like, oh, Supercell, it felt kind of bad for me. <laughs> you lost, and so we'll give you something a little bit easier. Maybe you have a chance, and you'll stay in the game. So let's try that out. Let's go ahead. Let's jump on the ladder. I'm going to forfeit <laughs> some trophies here, unfortunately. But, oh, you got to make it look like you're winning, too. you got to try it. You can't just, like, throw the match. You can't just, like, start the match and then give up. you got to actually try and play like you're really playing. And then, because I actually threw the match one time, and then I lost the very next next match in the uh, in the champ in the in the challenge. And so you actually got to try. And so, whoa, this one's gonna be a doozy, actually. Holy cow! I pretty much would lose this one anyway. I know it. What's that focused on? Um, boom, 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 boom. We're gonna have to log those archers away, even though that's not gonna do much for me. And holy crap, dude, I'm absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> Don't even have to throw this. I'm just getting smoked, dude. What deck is he playing, dude? This is awesome. And that ba baby dragon is staying alive for about a year and a half, so that's great. That's really great. I have not even been able to get a push together. Like, this is crazy talk. Okay, so that's one good thing that he's... What? Man, he's already got more... Dude, he's got so much elixir. This is crazy. Absolutely crazy. He was trying to go in for the kill right there. And I'm not going to let him. I'm just not going to let him. I'm going to take that baby dragon... Um, damage, and I don't think it's going to do too bad for me. Gosh, dang. Is it even smart to put a pump down at this time? Let's say I was trying to win. Is it even smart to put a pump down at this time? Yes, we're going to put a pump down because that's our only chance. Hopefully he doesn't drop a giant uh, right off the bat. Let's see what you got for me. Oh my gosh. I did just buy the stuff to make the Night Witch's staff, so I'm pretty jacked up about that, guys. Um... I think that it's going to turn out so good. I'm super excited about it. It's going to be... I'm going to probably work on it this weekend. Anyway, it's going to be pretty sweet. So let's go ahead. Let's get in there. we got to take at least one tower just for kicks, right, guys? We have to. So let's go... Let's just push the lane that he's pushing because I'm still going to have to defend. And if my golem out there should distract his troops for a while um, a little bit. That way, at least I can get something going. And he has a gun... Dude, this guy's got every troop in the whole book. Holy crap. 
Let's go ahead and log that and maybe get his other goblins too. Okay, that was a waste. That's okay, I can do that. What? You have a skeleton army too? Dude, <laughs> this guy's got everything, dude. I feel like he keeps pulling troops out that definitely I didn't think were still... Oh, my bad. Uh, <laughs> this guy's doing good, man. He knows what he's doing in life, that's for sure. So we got two baby D's headed over to his tower, though. I am not too concerned here. We're going to take one tower out, hopefully. Uh, looks like we're going to get a lot of log action in there. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Dude, we're just going town on this tower over there. Yeah, that's a tower. Okay, so let's go ahead. Let's drop Golem right here in the middle. And then let's go for the kill right here. <laughs> Wait, I'm going to lose this one, though. Watch. I'll lose, don't worry. Don't worry, guys. I know you guys think I'm going to win, but I'm not. I'm going to lose. He's got his baby D coming over. All he's really got to do, I don't know why he's getting so stressed out. All he really has to do is drop a giant over here, and I pretty much am toast. So, there's no way I could stop it. Absolutely no way. See? There you go. He actually listened to me for once. <laughs> Let's do that. Let's do that. Up there. There we go. <laughs> Those minions will go over there and do some, some, some fun stuff. Okay, so that is game over right so we lost that no big deal I'm okay with that so that's how we okay I'm fine with that okay so now this is not what I want to do but it is for my ninth win so we're gonna go over to the challenge here and we're gonna hop into it all right we gotta play real strong though we gotta play real good because I think we get a magical chest at nine wins which I'm super jacked up about so let's focus for one second here and let's get this taken care of I may go quiet because I'm really gonna focus and try and win this thing really 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 focus it really sucks with this deck if you don't have the elixir collector right off the bat I feel like it's a huge um, disadvantage and so kind of sucks that way Let's go ahead, let's take out that, boom, boom, that should do pretty well. Take that out, the knight should go down as well, without hitting our tower too much. I think we took a couple of hits, which I'm okay with. Um, full elixir, because that's what I do. I should not have dropped that golem. See, when I'm talking, I do absolutely horrible. Uh, I have no login cycle. Dang it! What the heck? How am I doing this badly? Just tell me how. Do I log this? Yes, I do. I'm going to log that. Oh, shoot. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Don't. Don't. Man, that was actually a good placement, guys. All his stuff, he's doing really well, guys. Doing really well. So, that is really unfortunate. So now, what are we going to do? We're going to go Elixir Collector. We have to build up some sort of semblance of an Elixir advantage somehow. We're going to... What? Are you kidding me? He has Rocket, too? Give me a break. Like, honestly, give me a break. This is crazy. Ah, what are we going to do? Dark Goblin, right here. I know it. I feel it. I feel it in my bones. Let's go Night Witch. Dark Goblin. No? Still no? He's going to go Goblin Barrel, right? So we're going to go... Let's defend that real quick. And then we're going to go Golem. In front of the Night Witch, please. Holy crap. I don't know how you didn't get in front of there, but whatever. Ah! This game's toast. Absolutely toast. I am not doing that great, guys. This is crazy. Absolutely crazy. Okay. Sorry, guys. I'm going to focus a little bit more here. Harder. So, what we got to do is go Baby Dragon. Let's go Baby Dragon right here. Um, there's no sense pump it up because he'll just rocket the crap out of it. Let's go like this. Log. Dude, holy cow. I thought that was going to delay forever and a half. Let's go, let's go, um, Night Witch right here instead, and then let's go, let's go Lightning all that. Boom. Okay, perfect. Um, if we can get that, oh, Night Witch, come on, get on the tower there, will ya? How's he got another, he's got another Dark Goblin already. That's good for him. Uh, did I waste a ton of Elixir? Yes. Let's go here, here, here. Uh, oh, shiz. I just screwed up. I flip in, I knew it was going deep. I knew it! What am I doing, guys? What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Oh, my flip. I cannot believe that just happened. Oh, flip. Okay, well, there's that theory out the window, I guess. Holy crap. I thought I would win for sure. 
I had that game in the bag. If I missed, I missed that one log, I think I just got screwed up. So that was on me. We're going to jump right into another battle since now we're 8-2, and two, so... <laughs> We'll play Colton. It looks like he's going to rock our world right here. Okay. Um, do, 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 do. Um, here's what we're going to do. We're going to go Golem on this side. We're just going to take out that baby D with our Mega Minion as soon as he locks. What? Two baby Ds? That's what I like to see. Uh, we're going to go like that. Are you going to splash my goblins? I didn't think so. Okay, we're good. Um, now, we're going to go Night Witch right here. Right there, right behind that Golem. We have a full health Mega Minion over here. A full health Golem and Night Witch. Uh, oh, Valkyrie, that was a good play on your part. Oh, that was a waste of a log, dude. Waste of a log. Um, that's okay. Whoa, maybe it wasn't a waste of a log. I don't know. <laughs> the arrows. <laughs> that was a good arrow. Uh, I've never seen somebody mirror dump Baby D's right off the bat. Um, maybe he'll just quit. Maybe See what I'm saying? So maybe what we got to do on ladder next time, my theory will work, is if we lose two battles in a row, maybe, and then go into a grand challenge. But you know how long that would make your challenges? Wow, I knew you were going to do that. Why was, what was I thinking putting the, that down? Of course he's going to take that out, dude. Um, let's go... Let's go baby dragon. Let's get let's let's get a let's get a push built up. Uh, the Mega Minion should do some damage to that baby dragon over there, which I'm not too worried about. And then we'll distract it for a while. Come on, come on. There we go. Another baby D mirrored up, dude. That is crazy. He's going to town. Let's let's see right here if I should have logged last time or not. Yeah, I think that log might have done good last time. Anyway, we got that tower down. So I think this is good. I think this is good. I think this is over right here. There's no way he can stop this, right? Absolutely no way. Let's throw some goblins in there. Whoa! What just took all that out? <laughs> I was not paying attention, but that was awesome. Whatever he just did, he rocked my world there. So let's go like that. And then he's got Miner coming in. We're going to go Baby Dragon. Uh, getting ready for his Goblin Barrel. Nope. Yep. Nope. Yep. Really? He's going to town on that tower. We're going to go like that, though. He, we had our log ready. He wasn't even, he didn't even know what was going to hit him, dude. Didn't even know what was going to hit him. So, theory still could hold true. You maybe just have to lose two battles on ladder. Although that last game, I actually should. I think I should have won if I wouldn't have missed that stinking log. It was horrible. Anyway, so that's, that's nine wins in the challenge now. Super jacked up about that. I am going to go ahead and we are going to open up this magical chest here. And see what we can do with it. Hopefully we get something sweet, actually, dude. That would be awesome. Um, where's it at? Do I get it now, right? Nine wins? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Arena 11, baby. <laughs> yes. Gold. That's a lot of gold. That's good. Uh, who doesn't love some zaps? Uh, hog Riders. Definitely need those. Give me some... Dang it. No legendary today. But I did get some lightnings. That's actually not too bad. Hog Riders, lightnings? Who doesn't love those in the morning? Um, excellent. So... I don't know if the theory works or not. It did work for a long time, and then I lost that first match, which I think I should have won. Oh, that is so frustrating. Either way, thank you guys so much for dropping by the channel today. Be sure and leave some likes, dude. I need some likes on my videos because that would be so sweet. Anyway, thank you guys so much. Take it easy, and good luck in the challenge, and good luck.